And now, an exclusive sneak preview. Antarctica, an inhospitable wasteland. But even here, on the Earth's frozen bottom, we find life. And not just any life. Penguins. Anybody see that? That's an egg. You know, we lose a few eggs every year. It's just nature. You know what? I reject nature. <laughs> Wolski, analysis? We are really awesome at this. I won. George Washington, man. He was in a cult, man. You didn't know that? I got done growing some lettuce, and uh, our Russians were growing onions. We've got uh, limited time, you've got lots to do up there, but I guess you That the world is flat. Because even if you finally accepted that the world is flat, it really change. And if you think this is all ridiculous, then the joke's on you. It's that the Earth is flat. To the flat Earth, those that think the flat Earth is just a psyop, that it doesn't mean anything, you don't get it, you don't understand what's taking place. If I say that the world is round, and someone else says it's flat. That's worth reporting. Hey, they, 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 they must have been founding members of, of the Flat Earth Society. They looked around at this flat, beautiful land. The Conquer the Flat Earth is the truth, but the whole entire concept of Hollywood, basically it goes back in time with the ancient Druids where they used to make witches' wands and magic wands out of the holly tree. This is how you get the name Hollywood. Okay, it's not what we're told. It basically it means witchcraft. You know, they're always going to give us false meanings and false definitions for everything. That's what it all comes down to. Now let's play this video clip and I'll break it all down again with Jimmy Kimmel interviewing Dave Chappelle. Start from the very beginning here, talking about again the whole the whole controversy about the flat Earth. Uh, who plays for the Cavaliers, he he recently said that he believes the world is flat. Is that a subject that you covered with him? Did you, are you aware of that? I wouldn't even know how to broach that topic. <laughs> Bird, is that what you think? Is that what you say? <laughs> I don't know. I guess maybe you just kind of, I guess if you don't, you feel it, it won't really make any kind of a difference. I don't, I don't understand the philosophy behind the flat earth theory. Why, why do you say that? I just don't understand. First of all, what difference does it make? <laughs> All the difference in the world. It's the foundation of the world we live in. And when the foundation is a lie, everything else after is a lie as well. There's no truth. Observation alone here. Where's the curvature? There's absolutely none. This is in Dubai, the world's tallest building. No curvature whatsoever. This same here. Absolutely nothing. So what's the deal? You just heard Jimmy Kimmel talk about curvature like it's obvious. When in actuality, it's obvious there's none. Okay, the only time you get curvature is with a fisheye lens camera. Just like you see here during this documentary from History Channel. It builds its temples among the nations. This is why Freemasonry is called an international enterprise. They own and control this whole entire world. And also here you flip over the Jimmy Kimball Live you have evil in reverse. I talked about the whole idea, the whole entire concept of doing things in reverse, live and evil, and you flip over again, turn sideways at Jimmy Kimmel, and you get your dual 33s all about masonry with this grand sovereign commander, the, the dual 33.